Hey yo, what is going on everybody? It is your boy Twitch here. I hope you guys are all doing well and having a friggin' awesome day with you guys in the world. Welcome back to yet another YouTube video for you guys that are here on the Twitch channel. And I just unboxed a package from G Fuel. Um, I didn't really feel like um, unboxing it for the video because it wasn't really anything exciting. But I did get a new tub, which I will be reviewing today. And I also got three stick packs, which include... Uh, Why well, I just got three stick packs. I gave one to my mom and this one is strawberry banana I got the two stick packs here and my other one is upstairs for my mom to try So um, yeah, we got these two. We're gonna be reviewing obviously one for the channel And maybe we will get a friend to review one and then We got a G fuel blue ice sticker, which I have lots of these now. So um, I don't know what I'll do with that and then lo and behold what we're gonna be reviewing today is French vanilla iced coffee. So I'm super excited to bring you guys this review today. We already got our shaker cup full of ice. Well, not full of ice, probably about halfway, as you guys can see. Um, and we're gonna be taste testing French vanilla iced coffee, see if it tastes any good. I'm super excited. I'm super nervous though. Um, I did spend about 50 bucks on this tub, which uh, in Canadian dollars. Um, G Field tubs are roughly about $50 Canadian. And um, yeah, so we're gonna fill up our cup with water and see how this goes let's get it all right so we are back we got our black dog taker cup full of water and uh we got a knife here we're going to open this bad boy up open the tub i don't really feel like doing the hassle of uh using my fingers to open it so i'm just going to slice it open and here we go Kind of nervous to be quite on. Oh, this part just came off. I'm trying to see if I can smell it right now. Hmm, kind of smells mapley, if that makes sense. Um, here we go. The, the, the powder taste, smell, powder smell test. Wow. Okay. Look at that. That's. It smells like coffee, that's for sure. Um, it looks like the tub is already has like eight scoops taken out of it, maybe. Uh, if that, look at that. Shouldn't G Fuel tubs be a little bit more full than that? That's kind of weird, but whatever, I guess. Um, I did see an electric shock video saying that the tubs, when you first get them, um, don't um, taste the greatest. So I'm gonna like. Uh, I'm gonna, t he told me, he told in this video to do this to the tub, so I'm gonna be doing that. Just to get the powder all mixed around in there. See if it makes a difference. He told me, or he, I'm not saying he told me directly, but he told the video that doing this to the French vanilla tub does make a difference. So I'm gonna be doing that just to get the powder all mixed up and do a little bit of shake back and forth and uh, get that mixed up there. I'm definitely, oh yeah, that's better. That makes it look a lot better. And the powder is a lot more fluffier after doing that. Wow. Okay. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. I'm not going to try to get smell my fingers or taste the powder off my fingers. Because um, I want to get the most unexpected taste. Or most official taste I can get for you guys here. So we're going to break off this cap part we're already a couple minutes into the video and we haven't even tried the g-fill yet so i'm gonna get right on that for you guys and uh here we go <laughs> man i am excited yet nervous at the same time we have a full serving of g-fill french vanilla iced coffee here we go guys i am nervous I am nervous because now basically if I don't like this then I'm going to be wasting $50 and uh, that's not what I want. So here we go, French vanilla iced coffee. I'm expecting this to be really foamy so we'll see. Nick, <clears throat> okay so
Here we go, guys. French vanilla iced coffee. Doesn't smell, you know, it smells like coffee. Lots of foam. Let's give it, let's give it a shot, guys. Huh. Definitely not what I was expecting. Um, obviously the water, um, plays a big factor. Um, I don't know how I feel about this. It's definitely a good flavor, but Hmm. As I'm drinking it, it gets better and better. But it doesn't fully capture the iced coffee flavor. I thought the flavor was going to be a lot more intense. Um, like a more creamy vanilla flavor. But uh, it doesn't really capture that, honestly. Um, I, I don't know. It's, uh, it's interesting. It's definitely an interesting flavor. Um, the flavor does come out. <laughs> yeah, I don't really know how I feel about that. Um, I, I, I feel uncomfortable giving it a rating, honestly. Um, the, for some reason, the the sleeve is really really loose and the tub doesn't want to stay on or the sleeve doesn't want to stay on the tub <laughs> um, I've never actually fully taken off the sleeve off the tub because the lid wouldn't tighten properly but man that's French vanilla ice coffee guys um, definitely by far the most interesting G Fuel flavor I've tried yet um, I was super excited for this and I'm still glad that I got it but I don't know if there's anything I particularly did wrong um, to prepare this G Fuel. Um, it's very bland, um, at least I find. Um, I don't know. I'm starting to get like mixes of, uh, you know, I'm, as I'm drinking it, I'm starting to taste more. Maybe I just had to get through the foam, but. I think this is definitely a sipper, not just a quick downer, just to, like chug the whole the whole thing back. But like I'm a huge a huge fan of coffee, and um, I literally just had a nice coffee yesterday from Tim Hortons, and uh, it's a big staple of Canada. But uh, yeah, that doesn't taste really like anything I had from Tim Hortons. Um, obviously, it's a G Fuel, but. I'm going to probably come back here with you guys in maybe a week or so and give you my opinions on it again in another video just to see um, how I feel about it like after drinking it for maybe a week or so. Um, but if I had to give it a rating, um, I don't know what I would have to go with because I feel like this, this is a flavor that could really grow on me. But as we stand right now, um, I'm probably going to give it a B, a B rating um it's not particularly i feel bad because i feel like i really want to like this and i really don't like it as much as i thought i was going to um i'm definitely going to finish the tub for sure but this one might take me just a little while um but uh, sorry for this video being so long guys um i was just trying to get portray my thoughts to you guys the best i possibly could um but yeah, it's just kind of a middle-of-the-road flavor, honestly. Um, nowhere near as good as I thought it was going to be. Um, for being such a coffee drinker, um, this doesn't really capture really that, that for me. Um, I'm, as I said, I'm still going to drink it, but you guys can call me crazy, whatever you want. But uh, that's just my opinion, and uh, that's really all I got. So hope you guys all enjoyed. 
thank you so much for watching make sure to like comment subscribe all that good stuff turn on post notifications just show your support and uh that's been it peace